Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Here we are. Yes. Lex of Las Vegas, social media team, mm-hmm. yes. coffee run. But wait, our guest appearance. Look at this. Don Turner. We brought a new face. <laughs> world, world famous yeah. Don Turner. Ooh. The man, the Woo. legend. Glad to be aboard. Yep. So if you have shopped for a car at Lexus of Las Vegas over the last, how many years, Don? When did you start? 12 years ago? 12 years, yes. If you've been around in the dealership somewhere in the last 12 years, you have definitely seen or met or experienced Don Turner, right? (laughs) For sure. He is our sales uh, sales floor manager for the store. He is uh, probably, um, I think other people, you know, would have some different numbers, but in my opinion, probably the best salesperson that's ever uh, worked on our sales floor because I had to sell against him and I know what that's about. <laughs> so, um, just great career, 12 years in the store, um, our team leader, and we're happy to have him on the uh, mm-hmm. the guest run this week. We happy to be here. Yes, yes, yes. So, Don inspired us to talk about what was different from Lexus of Las Vegas 12 years ago to now. And we have all kinds of things. Can you imagine when you work at a store? There's good things, there's bad things, but overall, Lexus of Las Vegas, in my opinion, I think everyone in this car just keep, keeps getting better. For sure. Always. But, yes. uh, Don, what was it like 12 years ago? Well, 12 years ago when I started in the car business, that was my first experience into coming into selling vehicles. And I used to hear so much about the culture of Lexus of Las Vegas. So when I came in and applied and went through the experience of first being hired Mm -hmm. and then being put out on the sales floor Mm -hmm. the culture the experience of the team that was already there just kind of resonated to what people were always saying out in the general public Mm -hmm. and now I knew I had to live up to that experience Mm -hmm. so my biggest and most concern about me is can I live up to it so you know with a few changes and coming in and thinking positive and being trained by some of the best salespeople in the industry, yep. I did learn to adapt, and now it's like I love the experience I've had over the years, and as I see the vision of the company continuously growing and prospering and bringing in a lot of uh, new sales associates that have quickly adapted to the culture of Lexus, It just makes me feel like this business is going to go on and build stronger forever and ever because of some of the great sales associates that were here when I first started. You know, they all had to leave and move on due to certain situations, retirement, change of jobs, different, different outcomes in their lives and changes in their lives. But what I do see from the core of sales associates we have now we will still move forward and grow bigger and better as the future holds for us. Yeah, and that's your job. That's yes. your job to make yeah. make it keep getting better and taking what was in the past mm-hmm. into the future in a new way. Yes, right. that yeah. is very true. And I hold high to that standards of taking it forth because of what I learned from the experience that I got from the past sales associates. I want to put that into the new sales associates to keep our culture going and moving forward. Yeah. Cool. So this whole conversation brought up something and we're going to keep it positive. Yep. Right. One thing we love now at Lex Las Vegas and one thing we miss. So Amanda, loud because you're all the way back there today. Hi. Um, Don's getting a call because he has to make, you know, some business meetings and deals and stuff. everything is growing with social media because that's kind of what it is unfortunately when my dad used to work here there was none Uh it wasn't like that it was a lot of old school so we have to adapt to what's happening in the world and if it is social media then we're doing such a great job with it and I'm happy about that one thing I miss a little bit is maybe like our holiday parties I used to like going to hang out with all of our co-workers outside of work Um, and I always thought that was fun so we can get to know each other because we're always in our same department but other than that, we're doing real good. I don't know. What are you guys thinking? Bryce? Um, one thing now, <clears throat> um, like she said, I love the social media part of it. When we started, we did not have that yeah. um, at all. Um, and I just really like doing this here with it, with you guys. Yeah. Um, before, um, honestly, the car, like all the cars we used to have downstairs, 
I do miss that. Like, I have everything I can take. He misses the inventory. He misses the inventory. Yeah, yeah. Uh, go to customer's house in this car and that car. I miss all the inventory a little bit, but hey, it's coming back. It is. Charles, you're. Um, I haven't been with the company for too long, but one thing I would say I would love right now is just the, just the company being innovative. Uh, if you guys been down here recently, you've seen that we've been using like Monogram. Yeah. You've probably seen it on our website. Just gives you an easier um, process, an easier you know transaction when you come down here and experience what we have to offer. So just the company being adaptive and you know moving with the times, especially what Amanda said with social media. We have a social media team, so got to love it. Have to love it. And I'll wrap it up for me. And all of you customers that have shopped with us will know when you crack the door downstairs and you smell the rubber and leather from all the cars in our underground showroom, it's the strongest smell ever. And I miss that. You want to know why? Because first, there's no cars down there, right? And, and second, uh, well, there's cars, but not as many. Yeah. Um, but my, my, just like anything else, your senses adapt, right? So I've, you, know, you wear a certain cologne for a long time. You stop smelling it. Whatever it may be, your senses adapt to it. Yeah. And I don't smell it as strong as I used to when I first started. Yeah. So it, I miss that smell. And if you haven't smelled the rubber and the leather of going downstairs, come check us out. We, we, that's, it's a part of the whole experience here at Lex of Las Vegas. So uh, that's it. We're, we're back the in the way. dealership. Hey, a little business. We're actually driving a right. 2018 GX 4660 460. certified. We do have one. Probably the hardest vehicle in the industry to get right now is this car. Sure. Yeah. Can't get them. There's a waiting line for them. We have one. So come down and see any of us. Say hi to Don, Charles, Bryce, me, myself, and we'll be happy to help you. Definitely. All right. See you later. Thank see you, you later, everyone. Bye.